Okay, I'm recording here. We good? <sighs> yeah, I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, welcome to Beers and Bars. Your place for rapid fire hip hop discussion. I am Kamal Kiddo. OT the Golden Child. Welcome back to another episode. We are back with our little sum sum Lagunitas, my fave. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Let's get into these topics for this week. Check it out. Um, topic one Jeezy's Trap or Die 3 mm-hmm. album review. Yep. Topic two Why You Sleep, Saba. Mm. Chicago, right? Shot Town. Saba Pivot. West Side, yeah, Pivot Gang, all that, yeah. True, true. Uh, topic three. The relevance of Gucci Man in the South. He's not the GOAT. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. What's the first one? Jesus. Here we go. Two minutes. Yeah, two minutes. Uh topic one. Jeezy. Trap or die three album review. How you feel about it? Uh Jeezy, okay, this is what he did. He recognized that he had went too far somewhere else with his last album and was mm. like, yo, I need to come back to what I used to do. Mm. Um, and for that reason, to me, it sounds a little dated. Mm-hmm. It's it's almost like he was like, yo, I need to get back to that Thug Motivation 101, mm. you know what I'm saying, 102. All, you know what I'm saying? Like, he went yeah. back to that. I think it does have some good songs to, on it. to the Trevor Dye mixtape. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. And he, I think he went back to Shawty Red, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know? He did. So yeah, yeah. Um, it sounds like it's from a different era. It sounds almost, like it's in you know the 2000s, I mean? the early 2000s. Yeah, you yeah. know. Um, I like G Wagon. I like It Is What It Is. Um, I like the joint with French going crazy. Oh, yeah, um, I do. I like that joint too. I would throw a six on it, though, six out of ten, you know? Because uh, I still me. think, I think it's good. It's not, a, it's not bad. It's just that it's, you know, like, from a different era almost, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, the thing about it is that, for one, um, it does sound dated. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It is going back. I haven't checked for Jeezy in a long time since the recession. Mm. That was his last good album to That me. joint was nice. Yeah. It was. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And, you know what I'm saying? I think he's having trouble trying to find his place yeah. in this era of music. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? His music right now doesn't feel timeless like that. You know what I'm saying? True. And you going back to, you searching, and yeah. you're going back. You're going backwards. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? On top of that, there's some lyrics in there that's like, you really just said that, dude? Yeah. That's the lamest, weakest bar I ever heard. <laughs> Don't do Jesus. He got like some that. weak <laughs> bars on there, G. Mm-hmm. I wish I could remember one in particular. That yeah. I was just like, did you really just say that, G? Yeah. He got some weak bars on that. Dang. Him, but um, right. I'm gonna go ahead and rate it mm-hmm. with you a six. G. Six, okay. It's some, it's some, it's some popping, it's yeah. some popping club joint. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna give it a six. Okay. Moving on. Uh, topic two. Mm-hmm. Um, why you sleep? Oh, Saba. Why you sleep? Now you gotta tell me about dude. Uh, why? Are y'all sleep on Saba, uh, Pivot Gang? It was so crazy about Saba. I heard a lot about him. I heard a lot about him. Well, he's but on. Uh, he's he's from the West Side. I you thought know what he saying? was. Um, uh, what's they crew, man? Vic Mensa. Yeah, he's he's Tans. he's cool with save all money. those guys. Yeah. I thought he was save money. He's definitely cool with all those guys. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but he. Well, what's funny about him is that right now, I it's the six degrees of separation. Mm thing with like I don't want to say yeah with kind of like me and him like he was on my little brother-in-law with T. Baker um, project in 2013 you know what I'm saying Baker shop he was on my homie huh yeah like they was he was in that mode at that time like Baker was like kind of popping a little bit he was on my homie Jitta Thomas um, luxury concept album I think 2013 2014 oh yeah that's right so you know what I'm saying I've been aware of this guy for a while and like right now he's doing his thing Um, he was on the Angels joint with Chance yeah um just dropped the album called Bucket List. Um, Word. I got to check Dope it. album. Um, dope album. Kept it local. You know what I'm saying? He didn't yeah. go up and get the, the singles or the, the features from this guy and that guy. Twisted's on the album. Uh, true, good song. True. West Side MC, Austin area. You know what I'm saying? Check him out, man. Check out Bucket List. Mm-hmm. I think that Saba is the next 
thing out of Chicago, man. Like word, honestly, word, yeah. word. All right, for sure, for sure. Yep, yep. Um, dang, do we even use two minutes? I don't even nope. know. All Just right, here we check go. Them out, that's all. Uh, topic three: the relevance of Gucci Mane mm-hmm. in the South. If you saw episode, I don't know what episode it was. We talked about Gucci, uh, the Waptober yeah. album, and yeah. it, at the end, he got he 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 has. Yeah, by the time we drop this episode, yeah. he will have dropped his East Atlanta Santa, the return of East Atlanta Santa mm-hmm. album. Yeah. This is how I feel about Gucci, man. You tell me how you All feel right? about Gucci. Hey, man, look, Gucci Mane is important. Yeah. All right? I think he is. He's yeah. important, man. And he's more important now to me mm-hmm. because he's a new man. He's right. a different Gucci. Yeah. And his message He's got a mess. Like, he's still rap about hoes and, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> all that good stuff. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Money and yeah. all that. But he's got a message for yeah. you, G. You know what I'm saying? If you really listen to rap yeah. and you listen to Gucci, he got a message for you. Well, you know what I'm saying? I, well, I think is why I think he's And it's important. a positive one, G. He, he has actually bred the MCs that you hear right now. A lot of, of Southern... Yes, he bred yes, Twenty One Savage. Yes, he bred. Uh, we don't hear a lot from Waka right now, but he bred to me. Yes, the yes. Walkers. Um, he has something to do with uh, Young Thug, G. That's what I'm saying. He bred a lot of these guys, yeah, and what dude. I mean is that they really looked up to him. He has relevance. He's, he's a legend in the South, G. He's yeah. a legend in Atlanta, yo. Yeah, he's a legend. You know in Atlanta. what I'm saying? Yeah. And he's very important to music in Atlanta, G. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's very important, Jay. Yeah. When I, you know what I'm saying? When I was when, on and on that one episode, what I was getting at is that I still wouldn't put him with the tips and all those guys. Gee, tips. Why is T.I. not even doing nothing? But he was, though, at a point. He's he a was. He's a legend. He was. Gucci has never been at that level. Gucci, you're right. Gucci, you're right. You're right. Is he, is he stadium level? Yeah. Maybe not. Yeah. Because he has a strong underground following. Yes, he has a cult You know what I'm saying? He has a strong underground following, yeah. G. That's yeah. time? That's time. Beers and bars. We out. Peace.